Hi there, welcome back to the Great Collection Unboxing. This week we have box 39. It is a very big box of mixed briars, so I have no idea what we'll find, but let's find out. It is a box of oh, stuff. Well, first we have a couple of companion animals. These are very fun. Briar introduced them um, many years ago, and we have the Dalmatian, and we have the Australian Shepherd, and they are a great companion to our model horses, and um, very nicely painted and detailed, as is usual for Briar. Oh, and then we have another companion animal. This guy might have come out of a set of some kind, because it looks like he's just the Dalmatian. They normally come on these blister pack cards, so this guy might have come out of a special run box of some kind. Um, we have a Heartland. This guy is a custom repaint by somebody of the 5-inch Grazing Mare. Just says Heartland. And we have lots and lots and lots of holiday stirrup ornaments. And it looks like they're all the same, the holiday stirrup ornament 2000. Then we have lots of the Briar 50th anniversary ornaments. I don't know if this was going to be a project <laughs> of this collector, but... And then we have a Briar brass and porcelain ornament from 2000 and it looks like that's the end of the ornaments so quite a few of those holiday ornaments then we have a fury prancer this is the black and white pinto fury prancer he is missing his reins and his saddle um, but otherwise in very nice condition. And the black and white Pinto you don't see quite as much. He's not a um, music box or anything else of interest. It looks like we have a couple more Fury Prancers. This looks like the Plum Fury Prancer. He has his saddle. Oh, he does. He has a rider. It's his little tag says, as is wrong saddle. Um, but he does have his Davy Crockett rider, but his rider has, oh, this is the wrong saddle. This is the Western saddle. He needs that uh, rubbery cavalry saddle. But the horse is in nice condition and the rider is in good condition as well. And this is another Fury Prancer. This guy's most interesting. He has a saddle pad, which I haven't seen. And he has a very pretty <laughs> rider. Um, it says Lucky Ranger and Palomino Fury, as is no hats or saddle or pistols correct saddle but the saddle is broken so um, this side is intact but the other side has a broken tapadero and he has the grommets and this saddle has the grommets and the cinch I don't know if these saddle pads were original or not I'd have to do some research and find out um, the rider the horse and rider are both in very good condition so they're a nice set I, I don't know you have to kind of sticky wax them on to make them look good, in my opinion. But that's just me. So that looks like the end of the Fury Prancers. We're getting quite an assortment of stuff here. Um, we have a bag of pins. I love pins, but after a while, you can get a lot of them. <laughs> it's easy for them to multiply. So we have I Collect Briar Model Horses, I Love Stable Mates, Biko, um, oh this one's fun, the Briar 50th Anniversary, Gene Autry's Champion, Zippo Klein Bar, Briar Dogs, that's a fun one. Um, I haven't figured out a great way to like display these, 
but they are fun. The Zippo Pine Bar. Um, so quite a few of the button pins. Then we have boxes. Boxes of horses. Let's see what we got here. This is the Quirky and Bimbo re-release. They were originally released a long time ago during the heyday of uh, Mickey Dolenz as Corky and Bimbo in the TV series. Um, he has a very fun, nicely decorated back. And it actually has Corky and Bimbo from the 1950s television program Circus Boy. So it has a little blurb on them, which is nice. I would love this set. The Circus Boy in particular is very nicely decorated in his face. And this back is really cool. I could totally see displaying this on the shelf. It makes for a very nice display piece. So that's really cool. Then we have... Oh. We have two. This must have been a Christmas present. We have two of the Briar Year 2000 Holiday Horses, which is the number 700400 Holiday Hunt 2000 Briar Holiday Hunt Horse. It is the Roamer in a nice chestnut um, with actually painted mane ribbons on his mane, which is uncommon for the Roamer mold. And he's got a really fun little Seasons Greetings 2000, and he's got um, the sticker 2000 Holiday Hunt. So they don't have a really nicely decorated back, but this is a nice set for the Christmas horses. They do a nice job on these. Um, we have one more of the companion animals. This is the cat. It is the Calico Cat stretching to go with our dogs that we got earlier. Oh, finally. And now we have a Briar Anniverse. This is probably... Congratulations, you have purchased a genuine collectible Briar date of issue 2000. Oh gosh, another holiday horse. This is how you got horses when you ordered them from the Sears catalog. Oh, no, it's not. This is the uh, Tennessee Walking Horse in Palomino. It was a special run. Um, Briar Golden Anniversary Celebration Piece, Certificate of Authenticity. Nostalgic and rich, glossy Palomino, reminiscent of collectible 1960s Briar releases. This is the glossy Palomino um, Tennessee Walking Horse. His tag says, Penny's Christmas 2000 needs leg straightened. I, I totally agree. Um, and he comes with his collectible anniversary neck ribbon that goes around his neck. Um, he's a bit of a day glow yellow, but he is a nice glossy, which makes me happy. I love the glossies. So, that was quite a box of this, that, and a lot of the other thing. Hopefully you enjoyed, and we'll see what we find next week. Thank you.